Welcome to Tooling Up, a series by MSC Industrial Supply Company that provides real-world insights brought to you by leading industry experts and aimed at improving the efficiency and productivity of your operations. Hey everybody, this is Eddie with MSC and welcome to this episode of MSC's Tooling Up featuring Kenna Metal. In today's episode, we're gonna talk about Kenna Metal's mini but mighty tool in the Dodeca Mini Series. And to give us all the information we need on this specific tool, we have our good friend from the team at Kenna Metal, Tony. Let's bring him on in. Hey Tony, thank you so much for joining us on this episode of MSC's Tooling Up. Now, before we get started, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself and what you do for the team at Kenna Metal. Well, hello, Eddie, and, and as usual, it's great to be back to discuss some of these amazing tools that Kenna Metal has to offer and with you guys at MSC. Uh, my name is Tony McLean. I'm a regional product manager for Kenna Metal. I've been with them a little over 11 years now. Um, basically, I'm responsible for indexable milling on a regional level for the Americas. So I, I do a lot of different things. I guess sometimes wear a lot of different hats, but I work closely with our, our global product managers around the world. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for joining us on today's episode. So now that we're set, let's jump right in. Tony, today we're going to be talking about the Dodeca Mini Milling Cutters. You know the drill. What do we need to know? Wow. Well, you know, we always know there's a lot of different choices out there when it comes to tooling, Eddie. So, uh, you know, one of our platforms that have been around for, for a long time, it's actually been a very successful platform for Kenna Metal, is the Dodeca Mini. And it falls in line. It's, I guess you could say it's, it's, the, it's the child of the Dodeca series because we have the Dodeca, we have the Dodeca Mini, we have the Dodeca, and then we have the Dodeca Heavy. So it kind of falls in line. The, the Dodeca Mini is typically for your smaller taper machines, you know, like your Cat 40 or your your live turret spindle machines, things of that nature for your lathes and different things. But it's 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 a great tool, phenomenal tool. And as we get into this, uh, hopefully we'll get to explain a lot of the uh, the benefits of this tool as we go forward. You know, and this is a wonderful intro to a truly interesting tool. Now, one thing, Tony, we hear a lot of individuals say how versatile their tool is. So in your opinion, how truly versatile is the Dodeca Mini Series? Well, I think when we speak about versatility, we have to kind of look at indexable milling tools as a whole, whether it's a it's a 90 degree shoulder mill, whether it's a round insert or something of that nature. But the Dodeca Mini has a tremendous amount of flexibility. First off, it has 12 true cutting edges. Um, it's capable to run in all major material groups, such as stainless steel, cast iron, non-ferrous, and your high temp alloys. It's very free cutting due to the different types of insert geometries and of course it also gives you the versatility to do a lot of different things with the cutter versus just linear I guess we would call it or planar face milling with it. No this is wonderful and as we talk more about this incredible and capable tool Tony in your opinion what makes it truly unique? I think what makes it unique is its capabilities and, and what it's able to do. And I guess maybe in layman terms, the functionality functionality of the tool, if I can say that word right. So again, you're talking about it, it comes in 15 degree lead angle, 45 degree lead angle and 60 degree lead angle. So, you know, the 15 degree, we typically call it the high feed. So, you you know, again, you get that very high feed, very high metal removal rates, all, all the different lead angles uh, basically provide very high metal removal rates. In fact, this tool typically provides up to about 30% higher metal removal rates over some of the other milling face milling tools that are out there as well um, you know it's got anywhere from up to I should say 170,000 depth of cut so you can get aggressive on sometimes on your depth of cut but you know when you get down into it you're able to ramp with this tool you're able to uh, helical interpolate, circular interpolate uh, in a hole on the outside. Typically with the hole, we do recommend you do drill a hole first before you go in and try to blow the hole out from solid material. But again, it just gives you all that versatility. The, the strong insert, you know, we have ground, we have pressed and centered to size. Uh, we have wipers for it. 
and it gives you the flexibility as, as a machinist, as a programmer, to be able to util utilize the tool and achieve those high metal removal rates. There you go, and we reference what one can achieve. So following, really listing all of those specific features that truly make it unique, let's boil it down, Tony, which what does this help the operators truly achieve at the spindle? Well, at the spindle, it, it's going to give you, you know, that economy of 12 indexes per edge. So if you have a tool out there and if you preset your tools, then it gives you 12 indexes. So the tool can stay in the machine even longer versus if you have to pull it out to replace the inserts in it. Um, it also gives you that the ease of, I guess, applying this tool because there's only one spare part and that's to screw. It doesn't matter if you're running the 45 uh, degree, a 15 degree or 60 degree, it's, it's the same insert. Again, those inserts are available in, in multiple different grades and several different geometries or edge preps um, to cover all the different type of materials you have or the different type of applications that you have. So it's just a very versatile tool, you know, times money and to be able to have a tool in a machine that's, that can run with 12 edges and, and have the metal removal rates that this tool does plus the functionality of it. Uh, it's kind of, you know, one-stop shop, I guess you could say, for a face milling application. Definitely a list of benefits that operators everywhere are trying to achieve. So this is truly interesting. Now, when it comes to really how accommodating these inserts are, Tony, what insight do you have for us? Well, they're very accommodating because I guess because of the flexibility of the different inserts. When I say flexibility, I'm talking about two different uh, nose corner radii that's available, talking about the geometries that are available, the grades that are available that cover the different material groups, and then the fact that there's also wiper inserts that are available. So, you know, you can, you can have a heavy duty rough milling, face milling tool such as this, and with the same tool be a fine finisher that provides a excellent floor surface finish. So Tony, we've been talking about flexibility as well as versatility, but how does this tool perform in various materials? It performs very well, whether, whether you're just doing kind of just a face milling or maybe you're doing mill turning or things of that nature, whether you're in, let's say, 718 ink nail or you're in 1018 steel. So again, you know, the, the 12 true cutting edges, uh, the different grades, different geometries based on the different types of materials that you're running. And again, it's all, it's all done with the same cutter body. So it's just the insert that has to be swapped out for the different types of materials. Easy enough. And with that being said, we've covered a lot of information here in today's episode. So as we wrap things up, can you give us all a quick recap on all the amazing things that we've covered today? I'd love to, Eddie. So, you know, when you think about the different choices that manufacturers have today out there in the shop and from things of reducing inventory, reducing tool setup time, things of that nature, you know, the DECA Mini gives you that flexibility again from a modular all the way up to a shell mill, one inch all the way up to five inch. And then the different insert grades and geometries, including the wiper that covers anything from high temp alloys to non-ferrous materials. So the capabilities of the cutter itself Itself, from ramping to helical interpolation with the cutter and not to mention just a simple fact the free cutting that it does in just a heavy duty or a fine finishing face milling application. Well thank you so much Tony for that quick recap. So for everyone else looking to learn more about the Dodeca mini series or all of the other amazing offerings that Kenna Metal is bringing to the market, where can we look? We'll just go online and go to msedirect.com uh, forward slash Kinemetal. Wonderful. Hey, well, thank you so much for your time, your passion, and expertise, Tony, on today's episode of MSC's Tooling Up featuring Kinemetal. Want more insights and ideas to improve the efficiency and productivity of your operations? Check out the Tooling Up video playlist to see how we can help improve your operations and subscribe to our channel so you never miss out.